Okay. We are continuing. We are part two of uh, Memorials Fit for a Queen. Because Teresa Donnell, Donnell Porter was a queen of Bitty Country. Teresa Donnell Porter uh, helped me also not only wrote uh, some books that never got off the ground, but we did wrote together uh, when in the battle. That the, the well, that was the main book that we wrote. We only wrote one book, but I don't know. I can't get anything much done anymore. But uh, she did wrote uh, help me with uh, wrote when in the battle, and uh, it's about a military family that goes through a lot, and uh, for the Lord's help, they made it through. And uh, and uh, Sergeant Perry was the main is the main character, as well as a, uh, his family. Uh, she was the co-host of the Big D Dawn up until her passing, and uh, also. Teresa Donnell Porter, I was going to help bring on a show for her called Princess the Bargain Hunter. Uh, she knows how to save money for different items that uh, people need and want, so I thought it was a good idea to uh, to do a show. And we started production, we started taping, and putting it on YouTube, well, the first channel that we had before it got trashed. Because of copyright, and I will be singing. There will be no music. I will be singing. This is for my late wife. This is more my late wife that I'm doing this for. I'm pretty sure, even though she knows that I'm further away from her, I'm pretty sure that she knows that I still love her. That is why I'm doing this. That's why I'm making this special for her. I would do that for the same thing for any other family member. I mean, well, I mean, I know my mother-in-law was, uh, my mother was very abusive. My, my biological mother was very abusive, but any of my other family members and my friends, I would do this for. And, uh, uh, I would like to thank Princess Danelle Porter for a wonderful one year of marriage. I would like to thank Princess Donnell Porter for giving me a dream come true because I struggled in finding a wife. And now I'm back to struggling, but I I mean you came to me when nobody else would. You came to me when everybody else was a scammer. A romance scammer. You came to me and made my heart happy. Finally, finally, I didn't care if we could have a church wedding. I could, I, I, I could have cared less if we had the uh, reception at the home like we did, and people came later. But it was only family. I, I just wanted to be married. I wanted to be a happy husband. I was. I was the happy husband. I was in a learning curve. I was still learning things. I haven't been a husband before. I'd never been a husband before. It was a new experience. It's brand new. All brand new. I wanted it. And it was suddenly taken away from me. It was suddenly taken away from me from a cardiac arrest, a sudden cardiac arrest. And, yeah. It's still very hard. Eight years, and it's still very hard. I mean, uh, I want to say this, that I know that when I sing these songs, it's going to put me in a vine emotionally. I know that it's going to put my PTSD working up, and I know that this week haven't really been ideal, like the day after 
podcast movement. And then right the night before I were to come back to Texas, you know, with the death of Bray Wyatt, Terry Funk, and the, um, and then now, today, when we're honoring the queen of Big D Country, the first, the first ever queen of Big D Country, I mean, I'm not going to pay for it, but sometimes it does pay off. Like when I went to that party that night after my disappointing, uh, after my disappointing, um, after my disappointing meeting greed, it paid off. I, uh, I paid off, it paid off until I almost got stranded, but nonetheless, my wife is, was still with me. She was still with me. Uh, Teresa Denner Porter, thank you. Thank you. I love you. I want to say thank you. But before I sing the song, I know that she probably wasn't a wrestling fan, but I am. Before I sing the songs, I'm going to ring the bell in her honor ten times in the memory of Teresa Denell Porter. Please join me in a moment of silence during the, the ringing of the ten bell. Ding. 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 Thank you. Uh, the first difficult song that I'm going to play is from that EP. Yes, EP. And it's a song that I nearly sing to her almost every night, every day. Can't help falling in love with you. I was going to sing another song, but she didn't like me uh, playing that much from uh, Robert Hook, but this one, this one. Uh, I think that uh, mostly every time. If you don't like me, get, if you don't like man getting emotional, this is the disclaimer. If you don't like a man getting emotional, please cover your ears or please listen to another podcast. Uh, please listen to another one of my podcasts as well. But if you can't take it that uh, the fact that I say this song to her every night, or any of the other songs I'm about to sing. Please, cover your ears. And I can't believe I'm saying this, but from a, uh, from Elvis Presley, can't help falling in love with you. I know EB40 did a uh, cover of that song. Why, man... There, only fools rushing, but I can't help falling in love with you. Shall I stay? Would it be a thing if I can't help falling in love with you? Like a river flows, slow surely to the sea, darling, though it goes. So big for men to be. Take my hand, take my whole life too, for I 
can't help falling in love with you. Take my hand, take my whole life too, but I can't help falling in love with you. Yes, I am crying. Literally, literally crying. I knew this was going to happen, but I'm doing this for a queen. I'm doing this for a queen. Uh, here is Islands by the St- uh, Islands in the Stream by uh, Kenny Rogers and Dolly Parton. Uh, my wife picked this as uh, our theme music, like if we was walking into WWE. I asked her to pick the theme music, and this is the song that she picked for us. This was our official entrance and exit music. And uh, I know it wasn't played at the funeral, but this is definitely going to be sung at a special memorial fit for a queen. And again, another song that I can't believe I'll do it but for my late wife. Okay. Here we go. Baby, when I met... And I know there's, I know there's two people, but it's just one, so... Sue me. <laughs> Sue me. But anyway. Baby, when I met you, there was peace unknown. I set out to get you with a fire to come. I was so terrified, there was something going on. You do something to me that I can't explain. Hold me closer and I feel no pain. Every beat of my heart, we got something going on. And the love is blind. It requires dedication. All the love we feel needs no conversation. We it together. Aha. Uh-huh. Making love with each other. Aha. Uh-huh. Islands in the stream. That is what we are. No one in between. How can we be wrong? Sail away with me. To another world, and when we rely on each other, ah, uh-huh. from a lover to another, ah, uh-huh. I can't live without you if the love was gone. Everything is nothing if you got no one, and you did walk in the night, slowly losing sight of the real thing. But that won't happen to us, and we got no doubt. Too deep in love, and we got no way out. And the message is clear. This could be the year of the real thing. No more will you cry. Baby, I will hurt you never. We thought, and then as one, in love forever. We collide it together, uh huh. Making love with each other, uh huh. I lived in the street, that is where we are. No one in between. How can we be wrong? Fell away with me to another world where we rely on each other, uh huh. From a lover to a daughter, ah, uh-huh. oh, sail away, oh, come and sail away, sail away with me. Islands in the stream, that is what we are. No one in between. How can we be wrong? Sail away with me to another world. And we will rely on each other. Uh-huh. From one daughter to a from one lover to a daughter. Uh-huh.
I know that there was more than just repeating, and I gotta get to another song. I gotta get to another song so I can end this. Uh, so this would go out to all the citizens. I love you, Teresa Del, Mo Del, Del Porter. I miss you eight years, eight years. The last song that I'm gonna sing is the most difficult song, and it is usually the Christian national anthem for all Christians. And I usually can't that I kind of steer away to it because it will make me emotional, just like the other two songs. Oh, my land. I'm going to do it. I'm going to take that risk. I'm taking a risk. Because I love my late wife. And it's important that for you citizens to know that I still love my late wife. And it's been difficult for me. Very difficult. Still painful. <sighs> Here we go. The song that was played in the funeral of Angel Grace. Amazing Grace. How sweet the sound. That's the moment like thee. I once was lost, but thou, I found, was blind, but now I see. To twas great that taught my heart to fear and blame my fears relief. How precious did that great appear that our I first believed Toward many dangerous toil and fear I have already come Toward great that brought me face the far and grace will lead me home. When we been here ten thousand years, for shining at the sun, we don't as day to think God's praise that we when we first begun and then it starts over a baby grace how sweet the help that saved a wretch like thee I was, was lost, but now I found was blind, but now I see. And I saw the house the last time I was at the Bahamas. I actually saw the, the house that the song was written on in the Bahamas on a bus. I literally just lost it. When they announced it, I literally was crying on the bus. I lost it. I just literally, literally lost it. Because I was late after my wife had passed. I still love you, Teresa Del Del Porter. I miss you eight years. You've been gone. You've been in heaven eight years. 